Exata uses the concept of real-time emulation to gain the properties that we just discussed. Real-time emulation basically boils down to two primary attributes. Number one is very high fidelity models so that one cannot tell the difference between a physical component and its digital replica. The second is to allow these models to be run at real time regardless of how large they tend to grow to, the problem of scalability. What Exata allows its users to do is take models of complex wireless and wired networks and run their emulations in real time so that external components that interact with it cannot tell the difference between interacting with the Exata copy or the corresponding physical network. How did we enable this? The fundamental aspect of design that sets scalable networks technologies products apart is a use of parallel computation. From the day we were created and we started working on the Qualnet kernel, we paid a lot of attention to developing a kernel that at its heart runs on parallel computers. Today, Exata and Qualnet are the only network simulation products that have a kernel that runs on a very wide variety of sequential and parallel computers. The parallel computers can range from dual and multi-core processors all the way to supercomputers. By relying on the power of parallel computation, we were able to avoid the pitfall that other network simulators may have run to in the past, which is, as the models grow larger, the computational needs become bigger. As the computational needs become bigger and they cannot be supported on standard sequential computers, the modelers are forced to either use abstractions or to limit the size of the models which they use to simulate. By relying on the power of parallel computers, what we were able to do was maintain the fidelity and allow the models to scale up while leveraging the power of parallel computers to give us the real-time speed that emulation needs. A very good analogy is with what sets Google apart from other search engines. Google today is clearly the dominant search engine, and it's very well known that it was certainly not the first uh, World Wide Web search engine to be developed. However, what Google did was correctly anticipated that the World Wide Web was growing at an incredible rate and would grow to encompass billions and billions and billions of pages rather than perhaps the hundreds of millions that it was at the time Google was formed. So they committed to using farms of servers, parallel computers, in order to be able to implement the search technology that they knew would be needed to uh, search through these uh, huge number of web pages that would eventually be deployed. In the same manner, scalable network technologies committed to the use of parallel computers so that as the networks would continue to grow larger, we would be able to rely on the power of parallelism to gain us the speed and scalability that we needed in order to maintain the real-time emulation for Exata products.